Hi, today I will explain to you how you can find streaming videos and DVDs. Notice I'm on the library homepage, library.rit.edu. You'll notice in the middle of the page there's a search bar. I will click on the catalog tab. You can type in your keywords here or in the search bar or click on the orange search icon. Now I'm on the library catalog search page. I'm interested in finding information about ASL poetry. Notice I put an asterisk after the word poet. You might be wondering why. I want to find variations in the spelling of that word, like poets, poems, poetry, etc. Okay, so I have results from my search. And I will look at this list to find a video I want. I can organize the search by date or time. I'm interested in the first, or no, the, the second title. Evolution of a Deaf Poet. So I'll click on that title. The record gives you the title of the performer, the name of the person, the title of the video, where it was published. It was published here in Rochester, actually, during a conference we had here in 1987. You'll notice there are two links. The top link is the YouTube video page, and the second one is called the Library's Digital Collections. You can click on either one to find the video. For my example, I will show you the first link. It's really nice because you can see this video with close captions. And you can also turn that off if you want. If you need the transcript, you can click on the three dots in the corner. Right here, the three dots. And click on and click on Open Transcript. And then you can see the transcript too. So that's how you find one kind of streaming videos. We also have videos you can find in databases. I will show you how to find that.
you can narrow your results to videos only. I will change my search terms to deaf poetry. I see something I'm interested in. Deaf jam. You'll notice that this video is in our database, Canopy. So I will click on the database link. You can see the page come up. This is an example of what it looks like. Also, when you click on more, you can open up the transcript. It also explains how to cite the video. You can set your transcript and caption settings. You can choose the font, color, etc. Now I'm going to go back to the library homepage. Now I want to find a DVD. It looks like there's one I'm interested in here. It's called Flying Words Project by Peter Cook and Kenny Lerner. It tells you where you can find the DVD, the first floor in the Deaf Media Collections. It also has the call number. You will need to write it down or send it to your cell phone. You can check it out for three weeks with your ID card. So that sums up my presentation about finding DVDs and streaming videos.